Steve, as you go forward, uh, it's a great opportunity to get back on the West Coast, get back home and uh, eat your own food, sleep in your own beds and, and be at home and, and play some Warriors basketball. Just talk about moving forward. Well, um, we've got a lot to look forward to. You know, we've got fans coming into our, our building for the first time in a couple of nights. And uh, that's going to give us a lot of, lot of energy, a lot of juice. We've got a lot of guys playing well. Uh, we've got a good groove, a good rhythm, and, uh, you know, hopefully we'll get Damien and, and Juan back, uh, pretty soon. But you know, I like, uh, I like the position we're in. We've got, uh, got a lot of home games to, to try to take advantage of and, uh, continue to, to build on our, our momentum from the last couple of weeks. Dre, the opportunity to go back home and play in front of fans and get some home cooking and, and just be back on the West Coast. Uh, talk about going home and looking to uh, win games. Yeah, I'm happy to go home and see my family. Uh, you know, it's always tough. Um, you know, being away from your family for so long. My my youngest turned seven months yesterday. You know, missed that. base. I think Bay's son turned two yesterday. I uh, missed that. You know, so just happy to go home and see my family. All right. Steph, Jackson, BNC Sports. Uh, next stop, back home to the Bay Area. Uh, fans will be in the house. Uh, just talk a little bit about headed back home and, and getting some uh, some victories. Uh, we're going to enjoy the, the atmosphere. I think I've talked about it before. It's, it's definitely noticeable if you have even just a thousand fans in the, in the seats. Um, it makes a huge difference in the atmosphere and whatnot. And, and obviously at Chase, we had what, three quarters of a season opening up a new building and then getting shut down. And we've had a whole season now where we haven't had any fans. So you're kind of sick of looking at the blue tarp. You want to see some bodies in there and um, you're going to enjoy the atmosphere. And and to your point, I don't, we don't want to put too much pressure on ourselves in terms of, you know, trying to get it all back and or not get it all back, but looking too far ahead in terms of how many games we have at home. We have a big game on Friday against a good Denver team that we got to uh, be ready for. When you do peek at the home and road ratio you guys have and the opportunities or the opponents you'll be seeing, uh, what kind of feeling do you get about what you guys can accomplish over these last uh, this last month? Uh, yeah, I don't think we're going to get too ahead of ourselves. Let's win on Friday and take it from there. Hey, Kelly, William Hammond, sports fans. Rap, uh, speaking of the fans, you look like you're getting back uh, home and you're going to have a bunch of fans. What is that going to do for the game and for the motivation of the team the rest of the way? Um, fans really, you know, bring an extra set of, you know, passion and emotion to the game. So I'm super excited to get back out and, you know, perform in front of them. It's also, you know, hear their chants, hear their, you know, their cheers. And it's going to be super exciting. All right. Thanks, everybody. Love is love. Right. What's that? Five out of the last eight. Go dubs. Nine out of thirteen. We'll see y'all in the bay. We got fans too. A uh, Chase Center. I cannot wait. Bring it. Let's go.